one of the games of the year. Canadians rock solid at home, 10, 2, and 3. Malikov had two assists and played very well. And with more on the game, here's Rob Sinclair in Montreal. It was an almost religious experience. Pierre Turgeon, the Habs' new French-Canadian hero, baptized in the Battle of Quebec. So when Turgeon sparked the third period comeback and the subsequent victory, it was as if ordained. We, uh, you know, we just uh, drive the net and, and, and we had some shot. We had a, few, we had a three, on, three on two and, and we just uh, put, them, put them in. And uh, that's what we have to do. We have to uh, keep going the same way. The Canadians are counting on Turgeon on two levels. First, he must use his skill to score. And second, find a way to get the skillful yet slumbering Recky and Dampus on the score sheet. Well, he's going to help. Uh, he's going to give me the puck a lot. He's going to, you know, score some goals himself. I'm going to, uh, you know, we're going to, so far, the first game, we uh, completed each other very well. Our line uh, uh, felt comfortable. We felt comfortable playing uh, together. And When you get a guy like Turgeon, you know, his skill levels, uh, you know, it's just, it's one of the tops in this league, and, and uh, you know, it's, uh, you know, it's going to bring your, it's going to bring your game up. Ironically, it was Vladimir Malikov who produced the first point of the trade, an assist on this goal by Lyle Odeline. You know, this is a good team with good experience in uh, NHL, good traditions, you know, it's, I think this is the best team in the NHL. But as was the case in this game, the pressure is squarely on Pierre Turgeon. Though he's a franchise player, Montreal is already his third NHL team. And in Kirk Muller, it sold its soul to get him. Rob Sinclair, TSN, at the Forum in Montreal.